Well, hello everybody, and welcome to my take a look at series of Anatopia. This is episode 55, I believe I'm doing today. I'm not sure the last one I did, if I did the number wrong, but whatever. It's what it says it's from, but I believe it's 55, and I'm having a look at the game called Niche, a genetic survival game. I don't really know anything about this game, other than I can got through the monthly hunter bundle. So, I guess we'll see. So what do we have? We have exit, we have help, we have credits, so we'll have the credits. I saw something about uh, recently, there's a Kickstarter going up, and I think when I glanced at it, it was the people who had done this, and this was used to be Kickstarter, I didn't know at the time. I, m I remember seeing that uh, a few days ago, actually. As of recording this, the Kickstarter's probably over by the time I put this up, because this is going for a few weeks from now. Uh, the 30th of October today. And I'm actually recording this, I'll see it's probably going up in November. But anyway, uh, check out their game on Steam, especially if you like the look at this. And there's some of their other games, and so yeah, there, there, Kickstarter backers. Okay, so what's Kickstarter for this? And I think the new game's got a Kickstarter too. I don't know if it'll still be running when this goes up, but as you can see. Anyway, let back up. I remember seeing it pop up, and I didn't really look at it, just as, oh, we also made this game, didn't it? Just, huh, is it not in my monthly? So I put in a list of uh, take a look at to do. Okay, settings. Okay, we have graphics. Good. Wow, awesome. It looks a very basic game, so I have an awesome animal texture resolution. Yeah, I'm doing high. It looks very basic to me. Uh, audio. Okay, how's the sound? It sounds okay, but again, music just in case. Copyright, remove. Language, English. Oh, that's nice. It shows all the languages here. Seeing some of the games before, I had to like click and go, okay, scroll through, scroll through, scroll through. See other languages here, you can just see them. Input. Okay, okay, moving, okay. What's over? Automatic restart time. Huh? Automatic five, what? What does that mean? Restart what, five minutes? Start exhibit mode. Huh? What, why is it there's an error to the play button? Okay, I'm a little confused already with this game. Is this the same as the play? But again, why is it buried in the option menu? Okay, graphics, quite nice. I'm sure it'll be music if I turned it off, obviously. You think this should have the sound if it's just no music? What the? <laughs> and why does it say play? Okay, it's weird, there's no sound. Like I said, I, I didn't start the, the music up, I didn't turn the sound off. What is this? Okay, this is very confusing. You know, there's a little growl or a foot or something. Can I make like play? What's this do? Tutorial. What? Yeah, let me come out of this in a minute. Um, exit domain menu. So you have play there. I'm just... T I can turn it back on. I just want to see. I just don't understand why that's in here. Does that sound now? To what I just did. Like, what's the difference between this, what's hitting in the menu, versus the play button? I just want to see if... So the music controls that, seriously? Okay, that's more than music. Apparently I need to keep it on for this. Unless they just play the music track over this. That's why. Oh yeah, it's got sound now. Huh, weird. Okay, it's, it's better already with the sound. See, see that, that was better. Arrgh! Why is the music track linked to the, the sound effects? Okay, this is definitely better now. So is this creature a tiger then? Or a saber tooth tiger, maybe? Or are they supposed to be their own like planet thing, this game? 
See, now you get the ribbit. Okay, that's a lot bad, but again, why is that tied to the music track? That seems weird. That should be tied to the sound effects track. So apparently I need to keep music on in order to stop sound. Okay, got the leaves again. Is he now happy with a family or something? Is it called genetics or ninja genetics or something? Isn't it? Oh, it's just playing it again, is it? It is, it's going through it again. Okay. Okay, this looks different than last time. Okay, let's go to the main menu and then try play. Let's see what the difference is. New game, new game. What the hell? How many new games do I want? Or are they supposed to save slots, I guess? Okay, top one. It's supposed to story of Adam. Recommended for new players. Choose your choose, choose, choose your start island for experienced players. Okay, so I guess story. What does this do? I'll change it. Okay, have a top here. Boom. Story mode. We're gonna get the same cutscene again. It will be a bit silly because again, what's the point of that exhibit mode if it's the same cutscene? Let's see. Bloody hell, it is, isn't it? Then what's the point of the exhibit mode? Skip intro. It's literally the same, isn't it? Okay, skip it because we've seen it. Okay, okay, please explain to me then, someone in the comments, what's the point of that separate exhibit mode and that five minute restart thing before me means then? What's the point? So to me, you just started a story mode, apparently. Out that hurt. You are all alone, stranded on an island far away from home. Okay, this looks like it's got to be some kind of turn based thing. The way they've built it, or are you going to be able to dig? Zoom mouse, oh, I was doing that anyway, but I was using the mouse wheel. Move camera left to right, I was doing that too. The arrow keys, tilt and rotate, uh, and drag, use QT or tilt to rotate the camera. Oh, okay, like this. TG, I think that's a weird way to do it. Oh, I can do it with the mouse too, okay. Oh, he follows. Oh, that's pretty cool. See that, he follows. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh. I think I broke his neck. <laughs> Click on Adam to select him. Okay, Adam. Try and see if you can still walk. While Adam is selected, click on a paw symbol. Oh, is this, so I click here, he's going to go to here. Click here, go to here. It means he can't. Oh, he can't. Oh, that's walking. He just slid it to the left. Well, that's depends the way you look at it. My screen slides to the right. Well, I guess if you turn around, it was his left. What a long day. Well, he slid his day over. Time to get some sleep. At the beginning of each day, animals regain their action points, which are represented on the gems on their chest. Oh, okay. So he's two a day. He's a bit lazy that he moves twice a day. <laughs> he's performed actions such as walking depletes one action point. Click on the end day button at the top of the screen and press space bar to end the day. And they both have a screen. Oh, okay, so two extras now. There seems to be plenty of food on the island. Let's eat. Animals eat one food per day. I can remember one per day. Make sure Adam doesn't starve. The animal counter. Okay, so let me try. He can move. He can move twice a day, but he can only eat once a day. So if the thing's three spaces away, you're gonna starve to death because you can't get to it in time. What? Uh, make sure Adam doesn't starve. The animal's counter in the lower right corner displays how much food is consumed when ending a day. Next to the food counter displays how much food has been collected. Oh, so he has some on him. Okay. Select that Adam, find a berry bush and move next to it. Collect fruit. Can I that? So, this one. So, berry bush destroy or collect. Oh, okay. Uh, the island seems to be deserted. Our pathway of stone leads to another island in the distance. Arminals? I, I, I was almost saying Adam then. I kind of mixed with like, animals. Grow old and die one day. The life bar shows an animal's current age and lifespan. If the bar is full, the animal dies. Okay, this bar. Where's that bar? Where's that bar? Oh, over here. Okay. So, Adam is three days old. Okay. I can remember, he's on a dying day, he didn't live long. 
Move add on to flower port, port. End the day if you need to refill your action point. Interact with a pointy travel stone to leave the island. Okay. So can I? Oh, I have to end the day. So was the space bar or did it just click that? There. Do -do -do. Oh, I have to click on him, do, don't I? I forgot to. How many of these can I take? So I end. Get some lots of food. Is this unlimited? Already had to disappear. I don't think nearly unless. Ah, okay, done. Okay, so point your stones that one then, isn't it? Oh, he's level six days. Hey, crumble. Oh, did I say 90 days and he dies? Oh, it's running. Oh, I can be free now. Remain alive 18 days. Hey, crumble. Do all your lives 25 days. Poor little Adam. And he spent it gathering food. Uh, oh, all animals on port fields migrate to another island. Animals outside the port leave the tribe and will be gone forever. That's how you travel, wasn't it? Right? So he's only in the tribe, he's gone forever to get more of a right? <laughs> okay, here we are. Behind you, the stepping stones crumble and splash into the ocean. It sounds like animals are living on this island. You smell the pressure of members of your species. You can toggle your senses by clicking on the button in the bottom right or pressing 1, 2, or 3. So I guess it's this. Move around and use all your senses to find the member of your species. O offer it five food to join your group. Okay. Click on this button or use one, two, or three desktop to toggle between your senses. Perception. Okay, if they're making it grey, what's the difference? Like, that's a bit of colour. It's supposed to be senses, but how's it work? It just kind of makes stuff grey. Come on, get up there! Root. Try to dig up the ground. Lower chance to see because of low digging ability. Oh! There. Eve. Offer five food to join you. High grass. The animal you, you found is a female called Eve. Adam and Eve, of course. And Eve uh, seems to like each other. Let's start a family. An, uh, an animal sex is displayed in the uh, Bottom left corner. Males have manes. Manes, okay. I guess like this up there. You can use the tab key to switch between animals that still have action points left. Move your animal together and mate them. Oh, get get some humpy humpy now. Okay, how does this work? Oh, she has points, so. Mate. Sweet, sweet love. Oh, just hearts grow. There's no actually down and dirty humping, okay. Eve is pregnant. Oh, bloody hell, you work fast. She, I didn't even see you touch her. He's just faces away the whole time and some heart's appeared and she's pregnant. She needs a nest to give birth. Building nests use nesting materials which can be collected by cleaning grass. Built nests decay over time and need to be repaired. Your nesting material counter is displayed at the bottom of the right corner. So here, okay. Find a natural nest or build a nest with Eve. Make sure Eve is... In a nest when ending the day. Okay. So can her senses do anything? She has food. Um, I guess just build one. Put away for a small chance to find nest material. Oh, I guess get clear it first. Build nest. In the day. Oh bloody hell, they pop out quick! Who was that? Your first oh look at the fifth together. In unison. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In unison. Whoa, 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 we're breaking an X. Break an X. <laughs> Your first offspring has been born. Let's see what it can do. Uh, click on newborn and open the skill tab at the bottom corner. Boom. Bottom corner is okay, this was aha, here we go. Show an animal's skill level, mouse over a skill icon for more information. 
Each animal has its own set of skills. The number below the skills icon show on the animal's level skill level. Some interactions require certain skills. If an interaction icon is orange, you only have what a small chance to succeed. Orange. Okay. Well, this is green. That means you can do it. Flying? You fly? How the hell can he fly? Well, none of the others have wings. Uh, some interactions require certain skills. If you, if an interaction icon is orange, you only have a small chance to succeed. However, over skills, see more information. Skills are defined by animal's DNA. Open the DNA tab. This. No, this one. What the hell? Animal's DNA consists of many traits which define appearance and skill. Each trait is defined by a pair of genes. Genes are inherited from the animal's parents. Uh, each parent randomly contribute. Contrib I said a word. Contributes. Contributes. One gene of each gene pair. A gene's tool tip shows which skills are influenced a gene pair can express. Complete, complete dominance. Only the upper gene of the pair is active. Etc. Eyes. So, co dominance. Both genes are separately expressed. Etc. Pause. So, an eye is dominant if it's a pause. What's that one mean? A double. Open mutation tab. Each animal has two mutation slots. Mutations don't affect the animal itself, they affect an animal's offspring by giving it a chance to express the selected gene. If any mutation is irrelevant, click on the mutation slot. It's so one of these 50 50, okay. Select the gene and confirm the mutation. Holy fudge. Ooh, red fur. Ooh, red brown, red fur, yeah. Boom. Um. Brown horns, black horns, short sighted, eyes, what? Eyes! <laughs> I hope he has eyes. Short snout, too smelling, ooh. Medium body, strong speed, stealth, ooh. Oh, they click off it. Why do I click the ticky thing? Additional information about an animal can be found in the bottom left corner. Animal ranks to find who gets to eat if food is scarce. Alpha animals can excel. Uh, omega animals status effects are displayed next to the rank. Click on the animal rank to change it. Click on the animal rank to change it to B. This. Okay, no, it wasn't that. Sugar. What did it mean there? Finally, you can get an overview of your group in the family tree where you can change the names, gems, gem colors, and rank of your animals. You can also fil filter your animal by skills and genes. Pay close attention to which animals you breed. Incest can quickly lead to sickness. Make sure each animal has two different immunity system genes or immunity genes to prevent this. Open the family tree and tab and have a look and close it again. Family tree tab. What's family tree tab? Ah. That is this one, right? Okay, so... Uh, sorry, the pipe going from the background. Um, so what did he say, give him what? Immunity. Okay, so have these. I just want to have changed. Feeding from the bomb, venomous. Ooh. So it gives immunity for having feeding from the bomb, or we get feeding from the bomb? Speed. It's the end of the story, your story begins here. Go and find a way back to your home island, but beware, many challenges await you. Adapt or be stinked. Okay, so we have to go back to the home island now. So... How do we go back to the home island? Oh, that rock.
Oh, can't he move yet? What's this? Oh, can you move one? Oh, because he's young. Okay, it's not going anywhere yet. What's this say? Track out opening up, low chance of sale because of low cracking ability. I guess I tried a few times, I failed. No, no, don't destroy, don't destroy. Okay. Animals are all animals on port fields that migrate to other island. Animals outside the port leave the tribe and will be gone. For no, oh. okay. Okay, so he needs to be on there, so we can't go yet. Or he would disappear. Okay, now it should work, right? It'll travel now, correct? Okay, there's only the kid left. <laughs> there we go, nice. Okay, let's so go have a new thingy. Do you want to happy happy again? Time to mate. Yeah. I guess you've had a pre made one. So, what's the perception thing? So, what's this? Take up low chance at same. Up into a kit. You can give birth. This is weird. It's cute, but I don't know if I like it that much personally. Just my own personal view. I can see a lot of people getting this game and having loads of fun with it. I just feels very figgly. And it's also got this big survival element. I'm not that into survival games. I find them a bit annoying. That's why with Star Citizen, the survival elements are abstract enough that you make sure you have a little bit and if you've been out for hours it becomes a problem, but generally you don't have to worry about it that much, especially if you're just going for an hour or two to a certain session. Well, this seems a little bit more. Gotta worry about it. And this, this all it is just keep giving birth and make sure they have enough food, so it's a bit of management basically. Oh, there's another one, finally. Thomas. So, skills. Swimming, how well? Camouflage. Hmm. This is one of these games where you've got to mess around with for an hour, two, three, four hours, and then you really get to nuts and bolts on it and it will grow and become better. Mm, jeans. So, how did this work? Medium ears, horns. Oh, okay, so it's like he's picking one or the other as it goes through, is that what's happening? So he has shoes and horns, but not a ram. I don't see any horns on it though. The way they have fall. <laughs> so, what did I say before? The, the stern body, did she get that? I don't know, how do you tell? 
water body, big body. Okay, I want to like it with stern, medium body or something. Ah, huh? He's nice. I like the color on of him. Okay, so he has cold resistance. Where he had cold and poison. You lost a poison resistance. You gained sense and underwater breathing. Oh, so you can actually breathe underwater. Yeah, I feel this is one of them games where you just want to sit down on your own, no bother for an hour or two, and just fiddle with it, and it'll be quite fun. It's not one of these ones what's brilliant for the channel. Because <laughs> it's more as you fiddle with it. Oh, that's cool, that's cool, and it's. Yeah. It's still a nice little game, though. I've got nothing against it. So, mail, mail. Be mail. Be mail. Community A, speed, speed. Okay, that's not changed. Okay. Food, because I think everyone needs food. Like, what else is on these islands? Because there's about water. Like, can she go down here? And, because she can. I mean, let's turn on it now. So she can swim then. Bunny. Did I get him. Oh, why did the bunny turn to chicken? <laughs> it was like chicken. Okay. I guess we have to move on. Look for more spots. Oh, it's over there. Well, we can explore this island first, can't we? She found some food. So I'm hoping next turn she can go underwater. How's that? What's this? Peaceful bear attack. Did I attack it? Okay, apparently we're attacking it. Okay. Oh, sugar. I don't bomb. Sea floor, dig up, find food. Oh, she's having fish down here, cool. How's my guy doing, life wise? Seven days, he's gonna die! Kill the bear, kill the family! Save your family. 
Offering free nesting materials. I'm gonna kill this thing. Oh, what's that? Bayan. Main life 51 days, peaceful, where five days old. I can't kill a thing. What the? Try to catch it. one go buddy oh my god what happened oh my god move where did my son go did I think I should kill him Son, where'd you go? Oh, did he die because I was out of food? Oh, sugar. Is that what happened? What the? No! It all died, I think! Power about to die! We lost everyone! At least we're going to. Seven. Affected by leech. This animal is being drained by a leech. Groom it with another animal. Oh, that's cool. This animal is being cooled down by water. It's wounded. Lick it with another. How did it wound it? I should not get him. No! Your species is going to stink. Okay, with the same bloodline, keep unlocked genes in the islands. I think I'll call that quits for this one then. I think in general, like I said, literally it's called Ninja Genetics of Evil. I think it's a very ninja game. It's one of them things, like I, I said it two or three times already. I think you're going to sit down, you know, you, you, you don't want to be an action game, you don't want to be a race game, you don't want to be, oh my god, I'm going to play like that like this, you just want to sit down. Don't worry too much, you just, eh. Ch -ch. And for an hour or two, just relax. I think it's a good, one of them games for that. For a game, do you want to? Do I want to sit there for ten hours on it? No, I don't. But for a game, I just want to. Much to do. I'll go on this for an hour. I'll go on this for two hours. I think I can see it doing that. So yeah, in general, I like it. It's just as it's called a niche game. I'm not as into it as some other games, but I do think there's a market for it. So well done, devs. With that being said, I'm going to end this. Take a look at it here. So please uh, watch some others in my series. And of course, if you haven't already, share the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much. Put some comments. What do you think about the game? And are you going to pick it up yourself? Please leave comments. See you next time. Bye, everybody. Bye.